right. So I suppose it, it's important to mention, I, I was thinking about it actually, um, that the dude I was talking about in the last video was Mexican because I was too busy wanting to say nigga. <clears throat> that I forgot. And I was like, yo, like, but everybody says nigger, so Chinese people like y'all some niggas because you say nigger so much, and everybody that I refer to as the the little young cut or when I was saying, talking like that because I don't talk like that, um, but it's it's funny too sometimes I think, <laughs> uh, 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 huh, uh, uh. <laughs> And, um, it's, it's gonna have to be a whole series or some shit. Um, because I get the feeling that his, you know, when, when he heard a, a, a video on a cell phone that was some news and shit, and it wasn't CNN, that his immediate thing was to guess Alex Jones right like oh Alex Jones you you like Alex Jones you 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 you're a Trump supporter oh, okay he's trying to play me um he'd have to get to the point where you would at least acknowledge that like because you don't know this but fucking I would be a little embarrassed actually to be listening to Alex Jones even though if you go if you go watch old Alex Jones it's 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 actually like it's not um what's it called like a t it, like you would feel like you're in another world if you went back and watched the MSNBC uh 5 months ago and what they were talking about because none of that shit came to fruition that they were talking about they were wrong about like everything whereas Alex Jones is, is still the same like but like Alex Jones if you've watched my other videos, I've told you why I don't trust him. Oh, I can't believe I have to go through that again. It had to do with the Sharif Salemi and this lawyer. And he is Islamic, but his name is Salami or Salemi or some shit. And he went to, um, after, after all of the uh, chaos about Ping Pong Comet, pizza or whatever he decided to take his kids there like his like and then you're supposed to imagine that there's some wife somewhere that, that doesn't have any effect on him what he says because even though that would be absurd that you took your on the day that you took our children to comet ping pong a crazy person busted then and blew and shot and fucking then um then you took over alex jones show and cucked his ass that dude cucked Alex Jones, um, like, with like he he didn't just get an earful from his wife. Then he fucking recoup he recouped, and uh, you know he he was, act, like his rendition is like, uh, yeah we um, we didn't hear well, like I didn't see the shooter or I heard a popping sound, and um, then I was face to face with the shooter and with a wink or a look or some kind of look that he gave indicated that uh he was holding a, a gun like everything was all fucking crazy and nobody checked him on his shit you do, are those even your real kids like do you even have kids or a wife why does a anyways he doesn't have to be a practicing muslim i get that you can eat pizza and it's just ironic that your name is salami and shit but is this fucking a clown show because I don't know if they can come up with some original ideas, then they actually had to kind of relate how much of a fucking clown fucking show it is. Like, it's of course it's a show, but you, I mean, maybe I don't know it's all a show or a work or whatever, because I'm just, it's something I just say, or but I think, but I don't actually know. Oh, it's already, oh, oh. But, you know, if you notice shit like that, and you're like, yeah, that's, I'll just call that shit unresolved. I'm not going to make up my mind. I like to say, talk about shit that I actually know. Bam. You know? Like, 
yeah, I remember this and that and things. Like, I'm still waiting to find out how that's going to resolve. You must be past it. You, you, you've you um, grown up and taken the high road and moved beyond it already. Oh, snap. Oh, now you're now you're interested in fucking uh, Epstein and shit. Now, now because uh, Trump's um, labor... Uh, what do they call it? Labor... something is position it's not not commissioners not that it's like labor something kind of some kind of fucking executive position labor some but okay yeah i know like you know who doesn't fucking like those people didn't find it interesting that epstein owns a temple that has an underground um labyrinth and he spent like 20 million dollars to fill it in with cement when uh trump um, uh, uh just made this um signed this policy to go after uh sex trafficking and then all of these fucking congressmen all resigned uh so if you know about that shit then you're fucking persona non grata like if that should even if you're still waiting on 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 uh how these unopen ended fucking um, mystery fucking are gonna resolve because you know you're not expecting straight answers so you're just wondering how it's gonna resolve and yeah I'm check I'm, I'm checking in I'm I'm still wait yeah even though I don't think nothing's gonna happen it's like fucking fucking what do you want to do why do you want to handle this you know but anyways that's out of my control and I find other things to worry about. So I was thinking about how, how you know, how to uh, build a um, financial institution that could work better than the government. Uh, you know, how you could use it to empower small business and shit like that. And I've been into all these different, like I've looked at everything from uh, starting your business fictitious entity name that you have to register and the classes at city college how to protect you and all this like i'm always interested in this shit and it's all everything you can find is on youtube so if i'm not talking about getting this money then tell me why alex jones is somebody that i have to fuck like i i haven't fucking um i have to divorce myself from alex jones okay what, what do you want me to say he's a piece of shit you know, you, so what do you want? Do you know? Dude, like, if basically I have to be listening to music or a comedy show, and then that's pretty much, you know, what? Then fucking give me a fucking break. I'm, fuck that! I'm black. You, you're like you're Mexican, bro. Like you should fucking if you want to push up on somebody like that, push up on another Mexican. Because how the fuck is it supposed to be any better if I let somebody cross um, cross over different races and tell people how they're supposed to get their team together though? Like he was trying to tell me, I'm I'm not getting my team together right, and, you, and you're not black or white or whatever. Like I, I don't, I don't even have a race to be honest with you. I could just fucking ar argue devil's advocacy, like a devil's advocate, like we've been doing for fucking hundreds of years. You know, that's a trip. Like I'm related to all these, you know, scallywags and shit. I'm, I'm related to Al Gore, like cousin. Um, related to Nixon, um, probably Hitler, shit. Sometimes I look like Hitler. Well, you know, you ever, you want like no, yeah, nobody's named fucking um, Adolf anymore and shit. Maybe I ought to bring that shit back. You know, because I'm trying to get my team together. I rock with my fucking team. Like you ain't shit if if you ain't about p solid partnerships and building um, quality relationships. <laughs> Like, what do you want to tell me about getting some money? Like, you like you ain't about shit. You ain't about when Donna Brazil says shit. 